Hello and welcome to the Dungeons of Dreadrock. I'm David in Art. Today we're checking out a throwback retro RPG that I know nothing about. So let's see what happens as we jump in to the dungeons. Ooh, here we go. Building in the backstory, of course. That's all right. We're all for that. I don't want to go alone, sister. Hey, so sister. The elders said you must. You must pay the rent. I can't pay the rent. You must pay the rent. Oh, how am I, su how am I supposed to kill the dead king all on my own? The elders chose you to do it. Women are not allowed to touch a sword. It would anger the gods, say the elders. I really wish they'd chosen someone else. All right. <laughs> I love the uh, 90 degree angle walking. I'm curious to see if that's going to be a thing that we do the whole time. Okay. Uh, so she stayed there the whole time? I, I'm so confused. What am I doing? I'm literally doing nothing. Am I supposed to walk? Okay. Oh, okay. I can click. Well. Sorta. Okay, I can drag. So if I drag... Okay. 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 But your sorrows start to overwhelm you. Okay. All right. So I'm going to see if I can move with something other than the mouse. Okay, yeah. So I can use my keys. Space bar doesn't seem to do anything. Control doesn't do anything. Alt doesn't do anything. Shift doesn't really seem to do anything. Uh, maybe different keys will do things as we go. All right. So here's my question. What if I just leave? Can I leave? <laughs> Taking a glimpse into the dungeon surely can't hurt. <laughs> well, you can't leave your brother behind. You'd, you'd be surprised how often that might be a choice that some people want to make. Okay. Dark roots that seem to emit an evil aura of infestation. Hard to say whether the roots infested the walls or the other way around. All right. Well, here's my problem. I don't have a weapon, so... Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, should I fight the zombie dude? No. We should not fight the zombie dude. Okay. I want... Okay, I can't do it. How do I fight? Okay. Having no instructions at all is not very helpful. Okay. I... Okay. Maybe I can hide? Nope. This is awesome. Uh, I have no idea how to fight. E, F, Q, X, Z, C. And you know what? I guess I'll just have to go through all the keys until something looks like I can either fight... I don't, I don't understand. Oh, okay. No. N none of the keys do anything. Um, okay. So, you come along. There we go. I tricked you. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, wait. I got a sword. Rummaging through a pile of dirt. You find your brother's sword. Oh, great. You hesitate for a second before you touch the hilt. The gods remain silent. The elders were wrong. Well, just because they don't do anything right away doesn't technically mean they're wrong. And this is not a sword. I mean, it might be, but to me it looks more like a dagger. There we go. Oh, you're going down now, my friends. Oh, that's a little gruesome. Yeah. Dun dun sh da da dun dun. Wait, wait. Oh. Yeah. Shunk shunk. What do we got here? 
contains nothing but a load of dust and ashes. This place belongs to the dead. Okay. Are you going to talk to me the whole time? Or, oh, wait. Hey, there's a, there's a menu over here. Gamepad. Quit game. So, is this a mobile game that was ported? Is that how this works? Okay. Whatever. Let's go through the door. Oh. The smashed wooden door reveals a stairway that leads deeper into the heart of Dread Rock Mountain. Fearing for your brother's life, you hurry downwards. Okay, here's the thing. My brother's sword was in a pile of dirt over here, right? So why was the door closed and locked? Wait, I, 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 I got something else I want to... What is this? You try to get a glimpse of the sewer cave behind the bars, but it's filled with utter darkness. Probably better not stick your arm through that thing. How many times have we heard that? Okay, what are, what's up with this? I guess what's in there, but you're pretty sure it's not a rat. The red pair of eyes seem to follow you with a hungry stare. Hungry eyes. All right, here we go. Sure, why not? Down the steps we go. Okay. Ashes to ashes. Chapter three. When when did we go to chapter two? I don't know, but there's a key. Um, that looks like it is a touch plate. That's probably not good. Fireball. Fireball. Okay, so here's the question. Nope. <laughs> That's not going to work. Uh, okay. Um, my question then is... Yay, we did that. Okay, okay. I see what we got here. A little spider action. All right, so now, wait. I gotta go. I want to see what this is. What up with the? Uh, oh, oops. Ah, <laughs> uh, Dave is not the smartest player in the world. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. There goes the spider. What do you do? Nothing. Oh, I can't go over there. All right, fine. I was wanting to see what's up with the uh, the glowing wall there, but and and there's probably a way to do that, and I'm just not patient enough because whatever. We shall keep descending. Chapter four, clack clack clack. How many chapters are in this thing? Like fifty. All right, we got little ants or some kind of bugs. I got a spider down in the corner. I have a locked gate. Oh, there comes the Spider-Man. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. There we go. What the heck, man? Dude. Okay. What? Oh, no, 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 I'm stuck. I'm very confused. Oh, no, 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 no. Holy crud, that dude is fast. I know, I don't have the key. How do I defeat this dude? Run, Luke, run. There we go. Honestly, I have no idea what I did any different, but sure, why not? Down we go. So, chapter five. Okay. You look familiar. Uh-oh. Am I going to fight myself? This is going to be like one of those lost in Zork kind of things. Oh, brother. All right, well, we got some people locked in cages and some critters. So, yo, what's up, peeps? All right, so the, the, the question then is, do we? did you see that in the upper left corner? There's like a little tongue that came out up there. Uh, do, I, do I 
trigger this and see what happens, or do I just go downstairs? You know what? Let's live dangerously. Oh, probably shouldn't have killed him, because he may not have been against me. Uh, maybe. Are you my friend? Hey, you look familiar. Great. That's why they named the level that. Uh, of course, that boy who was brought in yesterday. He was your brother, right? They came to take him down to the king about an hour ago. They say his crypt lies a hundred levels deep in the dead rock, Dread Rock Mountain. Behind an underground lake that can only, that only the dead can cross. I'm going to run for my life and I suggest you better do the same. Why is the screen doing that? Haha, <laughs> you're blocked. Can I attack you? No, I can't. Okay. Thanks for the rescue. You got it. A terrible smell. All right, so this is basically like a little RPG puzzler. Oh, this dude is going to kick my butt. Why is there a piranha? A terrible smell fills the air, and you hear a deep growl from behind the fountain that blocks your sight. Your mother's words echo in your head. Choose wisely when to pick a fight and when to avoid it. You got to know when to hold them. Know when to fold them, know when to walk away, know when to run. You never count your money when you're sitting at the table. Whoop, whoop, whoop. No, no, come this way. Ah, listen, you little... There we go. Come on. There we go. Okay, I don't care now. I'm running. Oh no. Ha ha, see you Mr. Ogre. I mean, I probably could have at least tried to fight him, but you, we all know, we all know it was set up for me to lose. Oh no, he's still coming? What? Oh, this is not good. What the heck? How am I supposed to do this? Help me, Rhonda. Help, help me, Rhonda. There we go. I mean, it didn't exactly do what I wanted, but close enough. I distracted him for a little bit anyway. Run. <laughs> this is not good for me. Not good for me at all. Run away. Run away. Okay, a trap door. So this is where we send the ogre. Into his demise, right? Oh, 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 sorry. Going the wrong way. Okay, what do we got here? So somehow, yep. Oh, I was not paying attention. Okay, that dude, I thought. Okay. Come on, dude. <laughs> dun dun da da dun dun da da dun dun da da dun dun A thin stream of hot lava trickling down the wall. Wouldn't be a dungeon without lava. Lava. I lava good dungeon. Oh wait, here we go, we got more of this. An empty old shelf. Ah man. But a load of dust and ashes. What a load of dust and ashes. I can get some sleep? Do I need sleep? I don't know. Sure. And the weariness of the last hours or days washes over you. You cuddle up next to it and fall fast asleep. A good night's sleep will restore your hit points. Too bad you don't have any. That's that is mean. Uh oh. Oh maybe perhaps I shouldn't have done this after all. Uh oh. Here comes the guards dudes, which I'm pretty sure this cutscene would have happened no matter what. She was supposed to wait here. I told you she was disobedient. She will spoil the sacrifice. Do you think she knows? Oh, she's going to know. 
She knows. She she doesn't know. Oh, she knows. Oh, you wait here. I'll inform the others. No way. I'm the one in charge, you hoser. I'm staying. You stay. I'll go. Take off. That's my translation. Here we go. Wake up, man. There you go. Good job. As you head towards the stairs, you remember fragments of a strange dream. Okay. Something about the village elders at the Dead King's Gate. Well, it was just a stupid dream, so you'd better get going. I, I, I didn't think it was a dream. I thought they were really there. Was it a dream? I have no idea. <laughs> this is... I don't know what's happening. It's a trap. All right, we'll do. We'll just stop here at chapter ten. Uh, once we once we complete trap chapter ten. Uh oh, we have a scroll. Ah, uh, so don't. Yeah, huh? Don't kill anybody. All right. So, but not only don't kill anybody, don't let anybody get killed. How am I supposed to do this? Oh my gosh! Now see. Uh, now here's the thing. Does that count as me spilling blood? Because I'm thinking perhaps it does. An empty old shelf. Yeah, yeah, an empty shelf. How about this one? A cupboard that has been emptied a long time ago. Long time ago. Okay, I mean, technically I didn't spill the blood. Ice cold mountain water? Probably poisoned. <laughs> uh, I'm going to die, aren't I? Okay, well, I mean, I guess because I didn't kill them. All in all, with just a, another brick in the wall. Another brick. All right, so here we go. I'm just going to go ahead and end things right here. So this is Dreadrock. How do I do I save games? Nope, that's not what I want to do. How do I, how do I, what do I do? Gamepad. What is a gamepad? Oh, okay. Well, I don't have a gamepad. I'm using a keyboard. So there you go. Options. Interface right. Lights. Hints after five minutes. Anyway, is this a restart thing? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to assume that when I quit, it's going to quit completely. I don't know that for a fact, but Dungeon of Dreadrock, I grabbed it on Steam for like, I don't know, a fifty or something. Anyhow, thought I'd give it a try. Something a little different and see how that goes. I'm David and Ark. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks to Hero of God, Gamer Gall, Los Wilco, Connie C, Zachary, 7220 Gamer, and the Maestro of Madness for supporting the channel. As always, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great day.